welcome all we are back at american falls hope everybody is doing well now at the end of the last episode we had just finished harvesting our sugarcane field and we ended up with about 200,000 liters of sugarcane which i believe it's like a two to one for sugar so that is going to give us about a hundred thousand liters of sugar that is ridiculous and i believe sugar sells for somewhere in the peak between 15 and 1600 dollars per thousand liter and the peak is next month so i want to try to really i want to try to get out of june as fast as we can so that we can get into july get us some cash it's already burning a hole in my pocket and i don't even have it yet so the first thing i want to do is go to the store and we are going to actually buy that fertilizer spreader that we've been leasing off and on throughout the entire run here so let's go ahead let's get our butt down to the store up oh, there we go and get that thing purchased i think it's going to run us right around four grand a little less maybe but that is even with the extension so it's not going to break the bank i probably should have done it I mean, at the get-go, but I was kind of cheap and squeaky. So let's pull our butt in here. We'll just go ahead and park right here. There we go. Okie dokie. And we are, and we will repair five grand. Not bad. Uh, we will not repaint. The paint condition is like nil. I'm surprised we even have any paint left on it. So let's go in here and down 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 and right there we go fertilizer spread oh wait i want to do this first it's just oh nothing absolutely nothing back in here right there we go the vicon and let's go with the extension i think i mean it's worth it it's not that much it's still less than four grand let's buy it i should have bought this thing away a long time ago i was just too cheap 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 Oh, no, turn it back on, you goof. So I think there is a gas station right over there. So we will grab this guy, run over, fill it up. Get it? Got it. Good. Let's pull our butt through here. And boom. Wow, that thing fills up right now. Holy cow. What was that? 206 bucks? That is about the same as it cost me to fill up my truck. It's a bit ridiculous. You would think a tractor would cost more. They use diesel, right? Diesel is like, I don't know, what, five bucks a gallon or something? This thing doesn't take much. Let's pull on in here and grab. We'll grab this guy right here. Maybe get it out of the middle there. Oh, that should be plenty. We don't need that much. It is not that big of a field. We'll go on over here, and I think this is it. This is the only thing that we need to do on the field work anyway. And kick it on, and you can see absolutely nothing. You know, it would be nice if this would change color a little bit, but you get nothing. It's just kind of, okay, did you get it? We'll check the map. We'll we'll make it work. No problem at all. It goes what? 12 mile an hour? That's not too bad. So this should be uh, pretty quick and painless to get this guy knocked out. Well, I think this should just about do it. It did not take much. Let's see. Let's turn around here. I want to look at the map. See what kind of grade we got on this guy. No, go back. And there we are oh look at that i would say that's like a c leaving that spot right in the middle i can't leave it there i gotta go get it i just didn't go far enough now i've been contemplating on how long to make this series i really don't know i don't know if i want to go by number of episodes or do i want to go by how much money we have i'm not sure i've been thinking about once we get to the end is selling everything and taking that money forward to the next map because this map we started with what i think it was 100 grand did i get it oh beautiful and nothing else no farms no nothing so then we ended up going from scratch which has worked out pretty good it's taken a while but we are finally starting to get something making some money so i just don't know how long to go how much 
money do we need before we say it's a success? So any ideas, any input would be good. I'm open. Let's drop that. Let's go grab our water trailer. And we'll go over here. Grab this guy. And like I said, I think we may do like one or two for the sheep, but I definitely want to do at least two or three for the greenhouse. Watch out for the crazy deer. No, that's where I wanted to go. But I think we are on episode 11. If I am not mistaken, this is episode 11 or the last one was episode 11. I did one of the two. We're on 11, I think. But I just don't know how far to go with it. Pull in here and we will get this guy emptied out. This trailer empties pretty quick. I guess it's not very big, so it should empty fairly quick. There we go. Let me go ahead and get this wrapped up. This will be trailer number three for the greenhouse. I put one trailer full in for the sheep. That should do them just fine. Then I believe the only thing that we need to do is cart some sugar cane over to the mill. Get that dumped in. Oh, I do want to. Well, that's empty. Excuse me, tractor. Let's grab these guys. Move them out of the way. Again, I do not want this thing to stop. Man, all this is in my way. Now, what's funny is I think I showed this before that we can actually put the lettuce in our silo, which I think is a little weird, but, you know, who am I to question anything? This it should do it. Yep, that's a mess. No, let go, let go, let go. Wow, it's like a flipping tornado <laughs> came through here. Nice, real nice. Neat and organized. That's the way I like to keep the farm. Well, I do actually, but I uh, just guess I'm a little lazy today. So let's drop this. Let's grab our trailer. There you go. And I'm thinking at least two trailer fulls. So that'll put 40,000 liters in there. Yeah, maybe I'll do three. Let's not, let's not run out. I don't think we should. We shouldn't burn through 40,000 liters overnight. But it is only 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Oh, there, sugar cane. All right. Whoa, I'm way out. What? <laughs> I rolled evidently a little too far. There we go. That's going to work out way better for us. And there we go. Trailer number one is full. Get our butt over there. Come on. Man, oh man. I think there's a little bit of weight here. This trailer, this tractor is struggling. Not horribly, but it took a little oomph to get going. Oh, don't go crazy. There we go. We're good. We are good. Trailer number three is going in. All right, awesome. So we'll get this dropped in here. Then all the boring stuff is done. Then we can move into July and have some fun making some money. That's what I'm looking forward to. I've been chomping at the bit to make some money to buy a new field. I don't know if I'm gonna buy any new equipment. I'm not really sure what equipment we would need. I know we do need a baler. Yeah, well, we need a whole bunch of equipment, really. We don't have much. A trailer, a very, very small mower. Yeah, we do not have a whole bunch of equipment. But I think first things first is we need the fields. We need to be able to make some money. And we are getting there, slow and steady, but we are getting there. So let's go park this over in our shed, and then we'll call it a night. Well, I guess it's a good thing we don't have any harvesting to do. It is uh, raining a tad bit. So what is, what is sugar going for? I guess that's the main question. That's really what I want to know. And where is sugar? There it is. So it is 1612 and going down. It's at Harris's garage. So let's go here. I know where that is, but we'll tag it anyway. Now, how are we going to transport this? I, even if I wanted to put it in our trailer, that trailer only holds 20,000 liters, which would be four pallets. I would like to go a little quicker than that. Now, there is one loading wagon 
that not loading wagon it's a low wagon that's what i wanted to say low loader there you go that's the word i was looking for so we have this guy right here it's 15 grand i think it's the cheap one is that the cheapest we got well we have another one is an auto load but i don't think it'll auto load as much as i want to put on there so let's go ahead let's get this and i will just lease this i don't think i'm gonna buy it maybe it would be a good idea but that i'm not always about good ideas start her up let's go back, get out of the way trey let's go back to the store uh, one more time i never understood why this road was a different colors because there's trees on both sides does it just get dirty right here that could be or is it a mistake maybe it's a mistake i i i don't know i can't i couldn't make this map i couldn't make any map so i guess i shouldn't complain no i think it's actually all going to fit on here i uh, i got a little lazy it started to get a little sloppy here at the top uh, but <laughs> it, it's all right it will sell just fine what do we have one more tell me just one more oh i perfect this guy and then i think we'll strap that top section down as well you on here there we go beautiful and that guy right there everything's good everything is good so we are going to the garage which is again that still sounds weird we're gonna go sell at the garage but that's all right as long as they're gonna give us what we have a hundred and fifty thousand liters on here that is a lot of sugar that's a lot of cookies right there or donuts or some fun thing it's all good to me i have a wicked sweet tooth i can eat it all i could live on sweets nothing but that'd be just fine with me now my doctor might say differently and my weight might say differently but it all I, I i do have a wicked sweet tooth now i have thought about doing some other production buildings i'm just not sure i mean we could do donuts or something we are starting to get eggs we could do bread but i really wasn't sure if that was the route i wanted to go with this series i wanted to kind of stick with the animals but there's really only so much you can do with the animals but we could also do the spinnery there we go two hundred and forty two thousand dollars that is ridiculous so we are going to definitely be buying something my goodness i think we're done with the trailer that was short-lived but it was well worth it so let's go ahead let's get this by guy back to the store anything in here what do we got oh we got a baler or a bale wrapper right isn't that what that is yeah 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 it's that long tunnel thing <gasps> there's a baler at 60 percent off now is that a wrapper it is a wrapper oh my 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 that that might be something we want actually i know that's something i want and for that price it's not the one i like but it is one that uh i think we're gonna buy it okay so uh foil color i like a different little little different foil color let's uh do i want that i don't know i don't really like that let's do green color of money that sounds good and i would like to do this i thought it always changed them to the ones you had on your other vehicle but i guess not and let's see hey there we go main color blue that is just fine so let's buy it yes there we go that's awesome we are going to need that probably next month in game when we harvest the grass fields then we can make some silage i would prefer to go bales than rather than loose anyway now our hay is loose and our straw is loose but that's all right we can you know from here on out we will go with bales it's just easier to transport a huge amount around not that our fields are huge but you get the gist i think bales are easier to measure out and stuff oh my whole point was to return this trailer and i got a little little distracted with the 
darn baler there. So let's go back into here and here and return. Yes. Okay. Beautiful. So we need to start thinking. We definitely need to start thinking about fields. Let's back up. Oh. Uh, is my tractor big enough for this guy? We'll worry about that later. That's what we'll do. Let's let's kind of look around and see what we have. Now I was thinking about three or four of them that came to mind is we have 37 right here are 59 it drives me crazy but 37 and that is 170,000 that is just so much 163 again the field's not that big we do have some trees but once you cut those down unless you replant them there's not much going on now 14 is a good size field and that is 112 that's not bad either now seven again i think that's too small that's 86 jeez five that is just a baby 72 oh cotton i don't want cotton so what do we got 14 is is that oats no that's not oats that's sorghum right yeah okay so sorghum is 14 also 27 is sorghum how much is 27 72 that's not bad what do we is any of it ready to harvest 27's ready to harvest i mean we could start with 27 sorghum's all right i don't think sorghum gives you straw which i would like a little bit more straw what does sorghum go for uh so well okay about 1500 per thousand and that's not until january but we will need money in january as well oh what to do what to do because if we get this one that's like the smallest field i would want to go with i don't want to go with anything smaller than that well, there's really not much else out there what is six over here Woo, wow, 342 grand. No thanks. I think we're going to go do 27. Let's start with that and let's buy it. There we go. Our farm is now a wee bit bigger, but we also need a harvester. Oh, I didn't even ponder that. I haven't even got out of the store yet. I just keep spending our money. We're not going to have anything left. And there's, there was nothing here, right? Eh, no, 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 no. So let's go right here. And Harvester, cheap. I think the Rasta Mash is about as cheap as we can go. And really, it should be fine for that size field. Let's go in here. I don't want really any upgrades. So let's lease it. Four grand, that's not bad. We can handle that. Now we need a header. Where a oh, where for is our header? Oh, so we have five meters, 5.7. Didn't we get in trouble? What was it? Did I try this one? The case that was 7.5 and that was too big. A six. Oh, I just don't know. That just, we could do with a 5.7. Uh, wait, 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 wait a second. That only does. Why is that over here? Shouldn't that be in the other one? Do these do? Yeah, these don't do sunflower. Shouldn't that? I, I don't know. All right, let's just go with the one we're supposed to get. Gosh darn it. And we'll lease it as well. 1200 bucks, almost as much as the harvester. Well, okay, so let's. Let's get you out of here for right now. I might send that on its merry way with a worker. Let's, excuse me, excuse me. That's perfect. That'll make things a little bit easier. So I guess let's grab this guy and 
head to the field. I think I will put a worker on the tractor, taking it back, and then they can grab a trailer and bring it over to the field. I think that is going to be the best road to hoe. Let's do that, and then we will cruise on over to the field. And there we go. Set destination right here. Go get him, Junior. All right, we will see you all at the field. There she is in all her glory. Man, that is one orange dang field. So which way should we go? Uh, I don't even know. It looks like it could be just square. I think it is. I don't think it's going to make any difference at all. So then let's drop that down. And we'll go right here. Is that harvested? Okay, it is. Hot diggity. Well, I guess we don't get any straw. I was right. It, I was hoping maybe we got some sorghum straw, but evidently no. I guess wish in one hand and poo in the other. See which one fills up first. There we go. All right. So, uh, I think we will probably just go ahead and kind of bang most of this out at least one harvester or two harvesters full then we might go ahead and put this on a worker we are going to need to cultivate this before we put any crops in the ground any more in the ground and i definitely want a crop that is going to give us some straw i want to make sure we don't run out of straw i think we're going to be fine for grass and stuff for the cows but straw is my only concern right now the one arable crop we have is canola. We don't get any straw off of that either. So we'll be pondering. I'm not sure which one I want to go with. Maybe barley. We could do oats. Oats is a pretty good one. The crop sells for quite a bit. And we get straw off of it. It's kind of like having your cake and eating it too. doesn't quite look like we're gonna get it all in this harvester full but that's okay I would rather have too much than too little that is not a very straight line I've got going on there darn amateurs let's get over here let's get this dumped out and then we definitely need to think about getting a cultivator and ourselves a cedar so I think what this is harvester number three going in now not bad, not bad. I think we ended up with right around, what, 16,000, 17,000, something like that. Maybe? Oh, that might be a little much. This doesn't quite, the harvester doesn't quite hold 5,000 liters of pop. But I think either way, it's going to be just fine. We came out a little bit of money. We're going to need that in, what is that, December or November, somewhere around in there. Come on empty out this does empty a tad bit slow for sure come on let's go let's go jeez get her butt over here and get this last little bit done and here we go finish this up we've got a couple little specks from bad driving there we go there's one i think there yeah there it is right up here in the corner we'll get it also Come on, baby, you can get there. I know you can. 
and voila another four or five liters perfect raise the header get over here dump this out then we'll see exactly how much we got and voila okay jump over so a little over 15,000 not bad at all that is pretty good I'm happy with that so we need well what do we need this guy needs to go to our silo and then what do we want to do with the harvester for one maybe I should shut it off for now come on let me in okay that's fine I guess I mean it depends wait I must have missed a couple specs. We may go back and get those. It depends. If I'm going to buy 14, which really seems like, I mean, really the only one that we can get. I don't, again, I don't want number seven, too small. If I want two fields, it really has to be this guy right here. So there we go. We just did it. Quit him hauling about it. That means I can take this harvester over there drop it off it will be ready to go first thing uh august august morning bright and early yeah that's what it is so let's just park it off the road shut that off we'll move it later let's grab this guy go get it dumped into silo it feels good just to be putting crops in our silo thrilled to death with that we really haven't done much what are we doing oh there you go I guess I was not in the center. It is a bit picky. <laughs> there it is. All right. So let's get this guy in here. Let's just drop it off. There it goes. In and out, in and out. We need, we need to think about a cultivator, don't we? cultivator what one did we use did we use the amazon i think we did or did we use the oh, 180 uh what is that that's five meters that's four meters i think the limpkin i think we're gonna go with the limpkin don't we have 160 horsepower in our tractor i think we do tractor 145 wow okay so uh and nothing in here no i knew that already but where did I, I lost my cultivator there we go i guess we could do the amazon that's 160. i'm not going three meters that just isn't happen our tractor's just gonna have to suck it up that's what i gotta say so that's fine let's lease it okay perfect now we're also going to need a cedar so right here beautiful right in the same area now what one did we use before i was pretty happy with that guy and oh here it is the mass card dun 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 let's take it ridge markers nope we will just lease that yes indeed okay so let's go back to the store one more time well maybe two more times we have to go We've got to grab the cultivator and the cedar. You know, we might be able to stick that cultivator on the front just for transportation purposes. I think we'll give that a shot. I think it'll work. So let's see if my theory is correct. Oh yeah. Makes us a little front heavy, but we hooked that cedar on the back and we should be just fine. My tires don't even come off the ground, barely. And got it. Uh, should I fill that up? I, th I should probably just fill that cedar up. I know I have a little bit of seed, but we can always use more. So let's go here. And let's just go two, I think. Yeah, let's do two. They're small. That's just fine. Oh my God, we're down to 36 grand again. What? That's no, that's just no good. Go fill it up, fill it up we're good all right we are off and running i know it's here somewhere in here my goodness it's all the same color where is it oh where is it i saw it i could see it from a distance but now i can't see it for nothing 
all right here let me pull the map out i mean make me do this the hard way where is it okay it should be like right under me right here well no wonder i missed it let's see we have none none oh i got five liters or something out of somewhere five liters really come on six eight ten eleven so was that it that was it 11 liters okay waste not want not i guess i don't think i need the arm out of there or pipe it's not an arm come on get over there speedy gonzalez get out of the way and we have our cultivator and stuff drop that right there drop you right here get our big old butt back here and beautiful uh should i run like a headland i mean headland i mean really just down this way you know i don't think it's gonna matter let's just go back and forth this way it's not as uphill so that's what i'm kind of thinking drop you down there i know i know oh look at that cultivation is happening so i'm not sure i don't know do i run a speedy here because i don't think i'm gonna run a speedy for the harvesting then the cultivating and then the planting all back to back to back i just don't think i want to do that so i'm thinking maybe do the cultivator only because it looks cooler <laughs> if that makes any sense a little bit more satisfaction when you're cultivating seeing the crop go away when we're planting you're really the rows change shape just a wee bit so let's go ahead and i and again i don't think i'm gonna do the whole one you know uh if i had a tractor but i don't have a tractor do i it's gonna say if i had another tractor we could go ahead and do them both at the same time how much would a tractor cost uh don't miss anything there goofball I mean it might just cost a couple of grand here put that on a worker we'll come back and clean that because i think i missed it eh, i did it's fine let's go up here uh small tractor that planter cannot take cedar cannot take much right right how much how many horsepower that thing take 120 hp which means we could probably get by with a little less that's what i'm gonna say so maybe what is that that's 80 oh that's electric we don't care 80 no 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 80 maybe a little more than that now this little massy might do the trick what is oh uh, 76 wow pendant 79 was it the massy i was just looking at oh i was looking at fuel <laughs> you maroon <laughs> That is not. So that is no 95. I'll hunt that. No. Right here. We're going to go with the Valtra. That's what we're going to go with. And we're changing. I don't know. I don't, was three point in the front? Yeah, we don't need that. No front weight. No nothing. How much is the lease? Uh, is it worth four grand not to have to wait? I think it is. We're going to do it. You only live once. So we will leave that guy to his own devices and we will jump into this and let's go down there and see if we can uh go at this thing with the double here what is that line down there hold up hold up oh wait cease and desist there feller let's get this let's get it squared up i'm sure that was me from being crooked anyway so we'll drop that down get this now what i could do is i could do a little alt zero and then we can pick up the pace just a wee bit hopefully just maybe downhill will pick up the pace maybe not uphill but that's all right 
Drop it. Beauty. Don't hit that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Slow down. Slow, 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 slow. And go, worker. Go. Go on. Get. Nope. Yep. Uh, so yeah, this side. I was like, which side do we hook up on? Is that the right side? I think that's the wrong side, isn't it? It is the wrong side. See if I know my butt from a hole in the ground here. And go, go, go. Perfect. And what do we want? We were going to go with oats, right? Oh, I just went by it. Of course I did. There. Now I've seen a couple of fields that were just oil seed radish. Isn't that just for fertilizer? Don't you just plow that into the ground? I think so. I'll get back in there. And uh, we are off and running. Yeah, there is not much of a difference when you're putting crops in the ground than when it's cultivated. There we are. Very good. Now, hopefully, uh, our worker can stay ahead of us. I think they should. Although our cedar is a little bit wider than what their cultivator is, but that that's okay. They should be going a little faster than us anyway. I guess you can't expect the workers to get it all now, can you? Let's get out of here. Grab this guy right here. Ding, ding, ding. Come in. There we go. Okay. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. We'll grab this little bit. I might actually just shove this on a worker also. Not the cultivator, but the planter. Come on, drop. Yeah, perfect. I think we've done quite well. I mean, we've got it harvested, we've got it cultivated, we've got it replanted. That is not bad at all. Now, I do have to admit, this tractor is not big enough. I think maybe I should have got one with a wee bit more horsepower. It has a little, a little problem pulling. I mean, it's getting the job done, don't get me wrong but it is a, a slow, slow process, especially over there. We were, you know, four, three mile an hour or something like that. Here, it's not too bad. It's fairly flat, so it does all right. Are we going to, I think we're gonna miss that. Hold up, let me fire the worker for a second. Not really fire him, just lay him off, I guess. Move over here, drop that down, fire that up. Yeah, there we go. They should be just fine for here on out. And you, do I need this cultivator? We will need it for field 14. Which is, isn't it over here somewhere? Over the tracks, nice trees. Uh, Something like right there, I think. Let's look. We are aiming, yeah, look at that. It is almost exactly where I am looking. I get lucky every now and again. N never mind. We won't, we won't go there. But anywho, I think maybe we should take all this stuff over there, drop it off, drop this guy off here. Ooh, ooh I was a little late with my button. Hey, I want to thank you all for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed. I think we did pretty darn good. And hopefully in the next episode, we will do even better. Thanks again, and until next time, see ya.